gentleman yields. The gentleman reserves. The gentleman from New York is recognized. The gentleman reserves. The gentleman from Ohio is recognized. Two to the Madam Speaker, yield two minutes to the gentleman from Texas, Mr. Roy. The gentleman from Texas is recognized for two minutes. I thank the gentleman from Ohio. The gentlelady from Texas asked, do we want guns in the hands of dangerous people? And the answer to that question is, of course not. But the question, the only question that matters is, who constitutes a dangerous person? Who gets to decide and why? That's the important part here. That's what we're talking about when we talk about due process. We have laws on the books, and I believe every state in the union, so-called Baker Act provisions, to civilly commit individuals who are a danger to themselves and others. We have such a law in Texas, but we didn't use it. And we didn't use it against a young man who wasn't in school, was harming defenseless animals, was talking about raping women, was clearly not well, and we didn't use it. There are more people killed in the United States by hands and knives than rifles. I don't want a crazy guy in my school with or without the ability to have a weapon. We should actually be serious about committing people who have mental health problems. That would actually solve the problem. Everything we are doing here today is a pretext. It is a pretext for targeting and confiscating and eliminating our ability to have weapons. When people say things, it's a good idea to believe them. President Biden, whether it's a nine millimeter pistol, whether it's a rifle, it's ridiculous. I'm continuing to push to eliminate the sale of those things. Representative Mondaire, jo Mondaire Jones, if the filibuster obstructs us, we will abolish it. If the Supreme Court objects, we will expand it. We will do whatever it takes. Representative Ocasio-Cortez, ban semi-automatics. House Democrats just yesterday, yesterday tweeted, semi-automatic rifles are weapons of war. Future Justice Ketanji Brown Jackson was applauding New Zealand Prime Minister's commencement speech about New Zealand's banning semi-automatic rifles. Representative Better O'Rourke, hell yes, we're going to take your AR-15. Even Representative Sheila Jackson Lee, the gentlelady from Texas, quote, I held an AR-15 in my hand. I wish I hadn't. The gentleman's time she has talks expired. About a 50 caliber bullet. The gentleman's time which has isn't expired. Even true. The gentleman's time this has expired. The gentleman's time has expired. Good job. Good job. The gentleman reserved.